As an art dealer, it's always been my ambition to find a place where 500 years of British art could come together happily in one location. And finally, I think we've done it. Landscapes, portraits, miniatures, still lives. We've hung about 60 pictures in this gallery over three floors. We brought them here, we've cleaned them, we've restored them, we've researched them. They're all here for a reason. Something that we do, which I think is central to our business, is that we love to bring things back to life. So what have we got here, Lawrence? It's quite interesting. A jolly Jacobean chap painted in 1624, covered in this sort of discoloured varnish. A particular favourite period of mine is, is undoubtedly the Tudor Jacobean period. Nothing quite beats layer upon layer of bad previous restoration just disappear and being faced with actually an object that is 400 years old, that is quite the transformation. As a team, we as art dealers really apply everything. We get a huge amount of pleasure from finding things that have been overlooked, misunderstood, and representing them. Being able to articulate aspects that, through the passage of time, have become forgotten. Portrait miniatures were painted before photography was invented. It was this incredibly personal object that initially might have been shrouded in quite a lot of secrecy. Research is so important because you're really giving the portrait miniature back its story that it's, that it's often lost. One thing that I've become very keen on is modern British painting, and that is done between about 1900 and 1950. So much was happening on the continent, and the non-abstract ones are the ones that have got probably the greatest potential. You can feel this personality in the way the leaves and stems express themselves. I mean, a picture is an illusion. It's a, it's a two-dimensional work. Just come back five minutes ago. Right. Ah. But it's the story behind it. It's where it fits into the great history of civilization that suddenly makes these things sit up. This is a remarkable transformation compared to how it was. We're not artists, but in a sense, we are adding something to the process. There's nothing more thrilling in a way, particularly when one is dealing with a really great artist, to bring it back to life.